Hello everybody, Scooter here coming to you live from the Granville Guitars World Headquarters here in St. Petersburg, Florida. Just wanted to chat with you for a few minutes about this absolutely wonderful Dr. Z EZG50 that we have up here on the bench today. Had a few little minor things that had to be addressed, nothing major at all, uh, mostly tube related, just had some worn out tubes. Um, this particular amp was built in 2012, so if the tubes that were in it were original, they've been used hard and, and were just due to be replaced. Uh, just wanted to show this thing off to everybody. What a great amplifier. It doesn't just sound good. Uh, it, it, it looks wonderful inside. It's, uh, this is the kind of thing that the technicians and amp designers dream about. It's just very clean, straightforward construction. Uh, excellent components used everywhere. Uh, you'll notice different kinds of resistors at different points in the circuit. Those are some uh, metal oxides uh, in the power section to handle that area of the circuit better. Uh, there's some carbon films uh, like right there. I believe that that's part of the bias supply if I'm not mistaken. And then there's also some carbon comps at various stages. Uh, so that they can impart their tonal goodness to the uh, stew. Um, so everything's been carefully selected, and it really works out well. I mean, it just sounds fantastic. Um, I'm not particularly a reverb kind of guy. This thing does have a nice tube-driven reverb with dwell and mix controls, and it sounds really good. It's a lot of fun. One of the things I particularly like about this amplifier is a real pet peeve of mine on some other amplifiers. We have three separate speaker outs, one for each of the available impedances on the output transformer, 4, 8, and 16. No switches. Switches on speaker outs are a problem. Um, they're typically made very fragile for some reason, and there's a lot of current flowing through those things out to the speaker. And they just, it's a weak point in terms of long-term durability. It's very thoughtful that they've given you the three separate impedances on separate jacks. I like that a lot. Um, as you can see, wonderful construction. Flawless wiring. Um, you know, the ch it's very heavy. The chassis is extremely heavy and very well uh, put together and designed. All the components are top flight. Um, it's just a wonderful beast of an amplifier. It really is. Uh, if you're in the market for something simple and loud and classic sounding that won't let you down, check into it. I mean, all the Dr. Z amps are fantastic, uh, but being a Fender 6L6 kind of guy, uh, this one particularly appealed to me. Uh, but that's it, really. I uh, just wanted to give you all a quick look inside this. This, again, is the Dr. Z EZG50 amplifier. Uh, go check one out. Do yourself a favor. It's a great amplifier. Uh, that's all I know for now. This is Scooter from Granville Guitars. If you got any questions about anything we do here, seek us out on the web at granvilleguitars.com or on Facebook. Have a good day.